When it comes to extreme zero turn mowers, Altos is definitely one of the most extreme brands you can get in America, especially their Trax lineup of mowers. These mowers will go where other mowers simply cannot go and will cut through stuff that other mowers simply cannot cut through. Plus, this year, Altos has announced a groundbreaking new feature on their toughest, most expensive mower, a feature which we will be covering in depth. In this video, I'll tell you everything you need to know about the Altos TRX 766 to help you decide if this mower is right for you. To support this channel, like, subscribe, comment, and visit tractorbob.com. Now let's dive in. The Altos TRX 766 comes with a 66 inch cutting width. The deck is fabricated from laminated 7 and 7 gauge steel. One unique feature about this mower is that you can choose between two cutting styles. The all-terrain mowing deck, which features snapback blades allowing you to cut through much thicker, taller grass without damaging the blades. There's also the arrow cutting deck, which is more of a finish style mower that gives you a super clean golf course level cut. This mower features more traditional straight blades. The aero deck features front and rear recessed anti-scalp wheels with fully adjustable baffles and side discharge, while the all-terrain deck features a rear discharge design and has chain guards along the leading edge, and the six snapback blades underneath are forged and heat treated for exceptional durability. Both deck options are a great choice. You can even purchase both or swap them out. And on the all-terrain deck, you can now purchase a deck extension kit that adds an additional 16 inches onto your mowing deck. More on that in future videos. The deck adjustment is a foot pedal plus dial system with a top lock for easy transport. The cut height variability ranges from 1.5 to 6 inches with quarter inch increments. Lastly for the mowing deck, access to the spindles is super easy. The spindles and bearings are the highest quality out there and you get a stomp pad for stepping on and off the mower. Now, before we go into the new feature Altos has announced on this zero turn mower, let's discuss quickly the powertrain, which is top of the line. The Altos TRX 766 comes outfitted with a 38.5 horsepower Kawasaki FX1000V, which has a displacement of 999cc, two cylinders, and a five inch cyclonic air filter. This mower holds a whopping 14 gallons of gas with dual fuel tanks. Because this is an EFI engine, you don't need to worry about choking to start it. It up. As for the transaxles, the 766 comes equipped with Hydro Gear's best zero turn transaxles, the ZT 5400s. These transaxles output 700 foot pounds of torque. Each transaxle weighs over 50 pounds and has a 1 and 3 8 inch heavy duty axle. At this price, it's not surprising that the 766 has the best of the best when it comes to both the engine and transmission. Finally, the top speed for the mower is 11 miles per hour. In the past, Altos has given you two track options, the all-terrain tread, which gives you better performance on hills and in challenging terrain, and a turf tread for those guys who need the cleanest cut possible. However, in some extreme cases, customers were actually rolling the track off the assembly when mowing up super steep hills or through really challenging terrain. Now. Altos has announced a third track option. As far as I can tell, the actual track assembly system is the same, but what they have added is a new groundbreaking tread option. The new track is called the TerraFlex system, and it's only available on the Altos 766 model. These tracks are designed for customers who cut in demanding conditions. The tread pattern is engineered for traction, stability, and a smooth ride in rough conditions. The tread is more of a zigzag pattern than the other track options and looks very impressive. But the coolest part of the new track is that the middle of the track is actually reinforced with a heavy duty steel spine that has gaps between the joints creating a central channel where the driving sprocket can actually penetrate through the tread, locking the track into place, removing the possibility of the track rolling off. This system allows the track and sprocket to become intertwined, making it the most suitable solution for mowing hills and tricky terrain on a zero turn mower to date. 
So we've already covered a lot of the really great performance features that come on this mower, but the 766 also comes with several comfort features as well. For instance, the track system, which we just covered, also features Altos's rear torsion axle suspension, which ensures that the track will contour to the ground surface for traction, while the track also bridges over holes for a smoother ride. Then there's the Torque Flex front suspension dampers, which removes a lot of the chatter coming from the front wheels. As you might have guessed, the front wheels are flat free tires and instead of a bald tire, there's actually a slight tread on the front wheels. The mower has two ranges, high and low, so you can switch between more speed and more mowing power. There are nice rubber floor mats and I like the footrest platform with grippy perforated steel. There is a nice size storage cubby and cup holder as well. There's also a 12 volt outlet there for you. Fuel gauges are located on both sides, one on each fuel tank. On the other side, you have a simple keyless entry pad with the Smart Track digital display that gives you service reminders and other helpful information. Also, there's a soft start PTO that comes standard, which is another really nice feature when it comes to putting less wear and tear on your belt. The ROPS bar is foldable and looks very stylish. You also have front and rear tie down spots to make it easy to secure your trailer. Lastly, the seat is fully adjustable with incredible detail to the design and stitching plus it's a suspension seat with a dial in the front that allows you to dial in your weight ensuring you get the smoothest ride possible and a smooth ride is exactly what you'll experience on these mowers between the tracks technology and all the other suspension we've covered the ride on these mowers is bar none the total length of the trx 766 is 96 inches. The width with the chute up is 67.5 inches. The height with the ROPS bar up is 79 inches. And the total weight is right around 1600 pounds. This mower is built to a whole different level of spec than what you'll find on less expensive zero turn mowers. Even commercial mowers out there have a hard time competing with the Altos TRX machines. When it comes to the quality of the components, parts, and construction, every angle of this mower not only looks sick but serves a purpose it's the perfect blend of style and utility i really like the red accents from the rops bar to the fuel tank support rails and driving sprocket and the gray laminated finish on the other metal components looks really nice as well plus i think the new terraflex track adds even more durability to the build quality and looks super premium overall a really impressive build from Altos, and just in case you didn't know, these mowers are coming out of Minnesota, so they are made locally here in America. All right, now that we've covered the Altos TRX 766 in depth, let's go over the price. Now the price if you are financing will likely vary from dealer to dealer, so I'm not going to go through the monthly payments in this video. You can always give us a call at Tractor Bobs. We ship across the entire United States or reach out to your local dealer if you have one. Also, prices are subject to change. You may even be able to find this mower for quite a bit less than what I'm putting out here in this video, depending on the manufacturer or dealer discounts that are going on at that time. So yeah, just give us a call for the best price at the time that you are watching this video. But prices will likely start for right around $24,999 on the Altos TRX 766. That depends on which cut option and track option you choose. Now, if you really think you need a track mower but don't want to spend this much money, not to worry. Altos has several options to choose from, ranging greatly in price. I'll have a video linked down below where I compare all the Altos mowers with the track system, so make sure to check that video out. I'd recommend this mower for anyone who's a homeowner or professional landscaper that simply needs a bad to the bone mower that can mow on steep hills and rough terrain or on extremely smooth terrain. Despite what you might think, the tracks do not leave ruts in your yard. Many people assume that, but it's simply not the case for these mowers, especially when using them properly. I'd recommend you take a test ride for yourself if you're considering purchasing one of these machines just so that you can experience it for you. Thank you so much for your time. To support this channel, like, subscribe, comment, and visit tractorbob.com. See you in the next one.